I really wanted one of those camera stabilizers like the Glide Cam. I think they're really awesome products. And you can get them online, but their pricing is so retarded. They're like $500. So I just went ahead and built my own. It was really cheap and not that difficult to make. It works really well, and like I said, it was cheap, but I had most of the parts laying around already, so it was very close to free. Another interesting thing is it kind of doubles as a tripod, although not a very good one. I'll have all the materials I used listed in the description down below. Kind of the heart of this is the gimbal, but uh, it's, it's, a, it's fairly simple. And uh, it's difficult, but it is difficult to explain. So I'm just going to let the video talk for itself. But uh, essentially, what you're doing is you're just adding two more axes to your bearing. The audio that I'm recording now is actually being recorded with a shotgun microphone, the newer 598 which was sent to me by Newer for review. Good. The next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take a flat bar and you're going to drill three holes in it. And you're gonna put a nut onto your threaded rod. And then you're gonna put your flat bar on and then feed these bolts through those, the remaining two holes in your flat bar. And then secure them with bolt, uh, nuts. Then you're just going to uh, begin reassembling your gimbal around the threaded rod. You can see here that you can get some good motion from the gimbal but you need to increase the diameter of the bearing so that you can hold it in by friction and complete the project. Here you can see the completed product and you can see it working in action and uh, no matter how much I move my hand, the, uh, the top part where the camera will be will always yep. stay right. somewhat straight and level to the ground. Here you can see some more, and these are just some uh, comparisons between using the stabilizer and not using it. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to uh, cut it off here, but uh, remember to like this video, share it, and subscribe.